Welcome to a special Faith Comes By Hearings March Update, honoring those who will at last have the opportunity to hear God's Word in their heart language. Because of your work, because of your commitment, and because of your passion, more lives are transformed to the glory of Christ. Each audio scripture created and released for access represents thousands upon thousands of people worldwide. We're counting down to 2033 with the release of new languages and ultimately to the time when every person on earth can hear Jesus say, I am the way, the truth, and the life. Welcome to The Update. Hi, welcome to The Update. It's a big one, I heard. Yeah, a really exciting milestone we're hitting. Yeah, uh, but that's coming soon, so hold on. Uh, my name is Patrick Gozier. I'm the Senior Digital Coordinator here at Faith Comes By Hearing. And my name is Maggie Witt. I'm a member of the Gospel Films team. I'm really excited. This is my first time at The Update. Well, it's my second time, so I guess welcome. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, I've been here just a little over a year, but we're going to go a little bit back in time and talk about when FCBH started. Yeah, 50 years ago. Yeah, more, a little over 50 years ago. More than 50 years ago, this paper says. <laughs> and it was all started by Jerry and Annette, of course. Yeah, um, so we're going to hear a little bit from them today. Annette, you had a dream. I had a dream. You had a dream of having the Bible available for children. Well, well, we, I started out recording here for children's tapes. And so that was great fun. And I asked Jerry one time, I said, you know, I'd like to do Mark dramatized for children. And he was like, I was afraid it'd be fish, make it fiction. <laughs> and I said, the Bible is too important to me to make it into fiction. So finally he said, okay. So that went so well that we started getting letters from parents that, you know, why don't you do that mark for adults? So then that was the next step was doing mark. And then, of course, Matthew, and Luke, and finally the whole New Testament. And then we decided that we needed the Old Testament. So you, Annette recorded the, the New Testament in a year. We were talking about it, and then I asked her, I said, how many studio hours was in that recording? And. Uh, she thought about it, and I divided it up, and I said, well, that's about six weeks of recording, actually. So you can do that recording in six weeks. And, and I, I encourage husbands to be careful how you do things like that, because our enjoyable evening went away. And, um, and she's got Irish, and so she put her hands on her hips and said, I don't think it can be done. I'll do my best, and I'll prove to you it can't be done. And. Uh, in five weeks, she recorded the first audio drama, New Testament. And that laid the foundation for what's taking place today, that we can go into a remote village with a scripting that was developed back in those days, and we can come out of that village with a recording in six weeks in a foreign language. Until then, it was always thought it was going to take years and years and years. This made it practical. Wow, so thankful for Jerry and Annette and for their example throughout all these years. You work in the gospel film department. Yes. Will you just tell us a little bit more about it, why you like it? Yeah, so something that really excites me about the gospel films is that they bring Jesus to life and they help people to visualize the context that he lived in, the ministry that he carried out, the places and the people that he interacted with. And I think it's just so important for people across the globe to see the person of Jesus um, in a historical context. I think it just makes him real to them. And Definitely. so it's so awesome to be part of that and to edit films for people to be able to experience Jesus in that way. 
the the program today is a little out of order than it normally is. So we're actually going to watch a gospel film clip first. And this language here is uh, is actually from Australia. Yeah, it's an Aboriginal language, and it's called Wangari. And we are going to check it out now. So we now have gospel films in 1,448 languages. They're catching up to our language recordings. Yeah, and can you believe that um, just eight years ago, we hit 1,000 languages? And uh, as of last month, we ended at 1,996 languages. Yeah, so we're now hitting 1997 with this upcoming language. Yes, and it is actually from Botswana near the Kalahari Desert. This is a pretty special language recording because the translators and all of the checkers and all of the actual language recording is done completely by women. And uh, this 1997th recording is the Shekelahari. Mojaham hong jeso aya mozingo obijwa na ine. Shekalahari. Le barutu abakwe le buntu jwa ba kyobe na nai. Ya ri u kemela khoro. That was 1997. That means the anticipation is growing for this milestone. This next language is 1998. Yes, this language comes from Indonesia. It's called Selayar. And we actually have a video from a pastor within that community. Let's take a look at that now. Kami telah melaksanakan perekaman Alkitab Bahasa Selayar dalam bentuk audio dan kami berharap bahwa Alkitab Bahasa Selayar ini khususnya dalam bentuk audio ini dapat bermanfaat dan dapat dipergunakan dengan baik dan kami berharap kiranya melalui roh kudus Biarlah melalui Alkitab Selayar dalam bentuk audio ini dapat menjangkau jiwa-jiwa menerima Kristus. Dan terlebih lagi kami menyampaikan terima kasih kepada tim yang telah melakukan perekaman ini sehingga kami berharap bahwa melalui rekaman ini juga bahasa kami yaitu bahasa Selayar tidak punya diimputah di masa yang akan datang. Ak nyara nyara isa ak lampa mange selayar. Risek rekota riarik naim. Anak anak guruna ak lampa todo imina handria. Nalohe pol. Okay guys, now announcing our 1,999th language. 1999. I hope you have your bottled water in the garage. You have your food stores. I don't know if our systems are going to handle the switch over. Patrick, I think we're gonna be okay. <sighs> okay. So this next language is called Asturian, and it's a minority language from Spain. Yeah, this is such an important milestone for this community. At the closing celebration for the recording of this language, one of the leaders of the community said, a language that does not have a translation of the Bible is less of a language. We know that every language is important to God. Let's hear a little bit of this one. Maritaki Tonkana Kiro Jesus Iking Tadakeri Asturian Atsiripeni Hatay Nampitski Kapernaum Ikanta Iman Siadaki Hitako Pirot. So, as many of you know, oral Bible translation, which is just translation of the Bible that's done orally, it's been revolutionizing the translation community and speeding up the process of engaging communities with scripture everywhere. And this Next language, our milestone, was one of these oral Bible translation projects. It's time. Years of work, thousands of people. Our 2000th language is... Oh no. Oh my gosh. I think it's happening. It's L2K. Language 2000. I don't know what to do. Just roll the video, just roll the video.
This is a milestone. In the heart of East Malaysia, a significant milestone has been achieved. The Murut Tahul people, deeply rooted in Sabah, hold a special place in history. They were the last tribe to renounce headhunting in Malaysia. Sebelum Injil itu tiba, khususnya di dalam komuniti saya lah, mereka pernah hidup sebagai komuniti yang kita panggil sebagai pagan, yang tidak yang percaya kepada batu, yang percaya kepada pokok dan sebagainya. Dia berdepan dengan perjudian, minuman keras, kemudian sabung ayam. Namun pun ada bahasa mereka masih belum mengerti sebaiknya dengan usaha-usaha pasta-pasta yang pergi sekolah Injil, teologi dan lalu kembali di dalam pelayanan-pelayanan murut dan menyampaikan sebaik mungkin ataupun seusahanya secara bahasa tempatan sendiri. Thanks to oral Bible translation, the 2000 language recording is now possible. We are honored that our language, Murut Tahul, is the 2000 to be recorded. Saya memilih untuk menjadi translator dalam bahasa murut karena saya percaya Tuhan mengenal kita seadanya dan bahasa yang kita gunakan ini lebih dekat dengan kita dan itu membuatkan kita lebih mengerti apa yang Tuhan mau katakan dalam kehidupan kita. Saya mengingat kembali Saya mengingat kembali macam mana Tuhan um, berbicara dengan saya dengan bahasa saya sendiri yang membuatkan saya yang saya tidak lupa dan Tuhan Tuhan mengenal kita dengan bahasa yang kita yang kita guna because they need to internalize they need to learn the story before they can retell so it's more on the transformation of the life of the people who are involved in the project Apa yang saya alami dan pengalaman tentang bahasa murut tahun ini itu sangat diperlukan karena kalau tidak ada seperti kami-kami inilah sekarang. Bahasa murut tahun itu sendiri sekurang-kurang dia para pelajaran ada generasi yang baru ini dapat memahami apakah tujuan dan maksud itu Alkitab. Saya berharap mereka yang diberi tanggung jawab untuk memastikan penterjemahan ini dilaksanakan dengan baik, bertekad untuk memastikan alat ini menjadi penduan generasi akan datang. The Murut Tahul people, they have embarked on a new journey, answering a higher calling. Every language recorded is the step closer to Vision 2033. Together, we celebrate this milestone and honor the impact of the word in every tribe and tongue. Raihi nutiung mayo Galilea. Murut taho. Asong ulun nilumulur ralibung Yesus. Suku Yesus inanding. Um. Well, I guess everything's okay. Yeah, I mean, it's more than okay. We hit 2,000 languages. Yeah, that's pretty incredible. We've come to this point. So much hard work from so many Bible translators and recordists and Bible checkers and community check and everything else. Yeah, this is really something we should celebrate. Yeah, we really need to, need to tell everyone. Yeah, we should. Should we? Can we? We're, we're going to go. Yeah, actually. we're going to go. Uh, Do you want to follow us? Yeah. 2,000 language. Yes, we gotta tell everybody. Maru to hole. Maru to hole. Where is everyone? I don't know. Hello? Okay. Uh, let me check in here. Maru to hole. 2,000 languages. Jared? I know Jared would be excited about this. <laughs> Wait a minute. Do you hear that? The great room. Okay, let's go. 
Something's happening. <sighs> 2,000 languages, everyone! Yes! We did, we did it! We did it on your feet, on your Woo! feet! We did it! 2,000 languages. Yes. This, uh, it means so much to so many. I'm just gonna run around. Who has a thought? Who has a great thought about 2,000 languages? She's like, don't pick me, don't pick me. <laughs> How has it been going through so many languages with text processing? Uh, <laughs> we, every language is unique. Every language is just as special as the people that speak it. And, and I want the Lord to know them. Wow, well said, well yeah. said. What about, what about audio processing and all of that's involved? What has it been like to get through all these languages? It's just amazing to see that each language is people and the language of, that they speak. And so these editors and all that's been touching these languages have been able to touch the lives of now over 2,000. Wow, definitely. What about, uh, everyone's avoiding eye contact. That's okay. <laughs> Let's give one more round of applause for 2,000 languages. <laughs> we also just want to say that every person in this room, every person watching online, I, I'm just personally so thankful to be part of this mission with you. I know that these 2,000 plus language communities are thankful for the work that you all have done and will thank you in eternity because of the work that you've done. And, uh, and of course, we do all of this work every day so that people can have God's word, words of life, words of life that they can really hear and understand in their own heart language. And so we just want to give all the glory to God who deserves it. Yes, amen. And we are not finished yet. Um, we are celebrating the milestone of the 2000th language, but we still have a lot of work to get done as we move towards Vision 2033. Um, we have a lot more to celebrate. We're gonna listen to the rest of the languages that were released this month, with the exception of seven extreme sensitivity languages that were removed for their protection. Um, we're also gonna see some celebrations from around the world. But first, let's hear a little bit more from our founders, Jerry and Annette. This movement of building on Annette's dream of an audio drama recording for kids, blossoming into 2,000 languages being recorded, we're celebrating that is, is a marvelous uh, step for us. We want to see every language recorded and every people group to have a, a Bible in their heart language that they can understand. Assyrian. Jesus, Dani, Lower Grand Valley. Apuni Dafe. We have reached 2,000 languages. Hooray! Glory be to God. 2,000 languages. We are celebrating here in Tanzania. We are very happy. We are celebrating together. Yay. 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 Yogi <laughs> Lolo. Nabuya Asakura to Amu Uasete. Pacha Parbuyasu. Marwari Southern. Apre Chilome. Pater Jura Tundia. 
le poil pour Jesse Bufirat. Mon mon ba. Car tout le monde est au nain. Celebrating the release of 2000 languages. Praise the Lord. Amen. 2000 languages. Let's celebrate. Hooray. Assalamu alaikum. This is Garlic. Nunuwe kanyo nuki logo wake Muda uchoko, yesa jauku mche umonga u Nindi Keme kwa naini Alongwe Zezi zwa nozoto onzo ee Nuni Northern Alea wa kapa naim Sena gaunan tagit Alikur Kisi Ignes Hig Ikiya vye Jesus chivi Tuwarle Pisare Yesu upuga ijira kareka tapa ya kase naini We are so blessed to hear that FCB has taught the malishan of 2000 languages Celebrating on the occasion of 2000 language release. Hadiosi, hel. Toho lobal. Yahila ha Christiano. Rangte imongreba. Tutsa. Irathani munchan ha. Hesa wasit lolo watho. Kwadiga. Yesu ta kuslim kisha. Wandi. Tihuni mi kwe der. Am yo no si shoho. Wepa. Otu ba jukuno. Ati odu. Mune ma evi. Yaoma. Yesu wa ile mbongi. Did you mind if Zumbo? Yes, it's about this. I got a good. I was asking the Lord what the boundaries are. I think every person, every ministry has an anointing boundary. And I was asking the Lord, what are the boundaries you've set for this ministry? And you set the boundaries, Lord. I'll, I'll work the field right up to the fence line. I won't go over it, but I'll work it right up to the fence line. You tell me where the boundaries are and I'll get there. And the Lord spoke to me and said, there are no boundaries when it comes to languages. And every person should have the, the scripture and the language they understand so that they can go to the truth, the source of the truth. I could see that, that the torch is being handed off to you guys. We all have a time. All right, so Faith Comes By Hearing has released this month 37 new audio scripture recordings, bringing our grand total to 2033. Twenty thirty three, a great reminder of what's still ahead of us. And uh, you might be wondering if you're if you're new around here, why are we holding thirty seven balloons? Well, it's to celebrate uh, all the celebrations of the past, where we used to go outside and release balloons into the sky. So, in honor of that, we will uh, release them into the ceiling, <laughs> and then quickly take them down so Bill doesn't kill us. Uh, so let's count to three, ready? One, two, two three! three. Yeah. Hey! <laughs> and, uh, and Leanne is gonna pray for us as we finish. I'd like to just say just a couple things before we pray. Um, in 2012, Jerry came to Jana and said, we used to celebrate every language that was released. And at that time we had 703 languages. And he said, it's important that we do that. So we started a monthly celebration. And now 12 years later, we almost have 200% more languages. And then the second thing is, first of all, was this a fantastic update? <laughs> Well done, well done. And I was gonna say, uh, what Annette said, is it's striking that I'm a start in 1985, and I'm the generation that built with, on Jerry and Annette, and now here is the next generation. And we are handing the torch to you, and already, well done. Thank you, Jesus. Father, in Jesus' name, thank you. Thank you for letting us be a part of getting your pure word to people. Thank you for, like the sister that told us today, that she heard God's voice in her own language for the first time. Thank you. Lord, bless this dear group. Bless our dear family internationally. Give us peace. 
by the Holy Spirit, unite us in one purpose, Lord. And we thank you and we give you all the glory. And all the people said, Amen. Well, thank you all for joining us for the March update. We'll see you next month.